Just like to take a few minutes and give you some thoughts and ideas from us about procedures to put in place when reopening the hotels, which is happening over the next few weeks. And at the risk of sounding a bit like a broken record and stuff you've heard already, it is all about the procedures. So if we can start with before the guest even gets to the hotel, how are we going to check the guest in? Are we still going to have check-in at the hotel, which we probably have to have, but can we actually make them check-in prior to getting to the property? Kind of like the airline model. Can we give the guest a check-in via their mobile phone so they can check in at that point, choose the room, we can upsell to them at that point and perhaps get them to sign the guest registration form even before they get to the property. Once they get to the property, again, have they signed the registration form? If not, can we have a, perhaps an iPad mini distance away from the reception desk so they can sign that digitally while distancing away from the reception team? We then move on to room access, how they're going to access the rooms. Some hotels will have digital access from the, uh, the keys themselves so that the, the guest can use the mobile phone to access the room. For those with the, the old fashioned, the, the plastic keys, how are we going to give the plastic key to the guest? Are this going to be in a secured envelope, cleaned envelope, or are we going to have a key generating machine that the guest can use a QR code to generate their own key? Either are valid. Once the guest gets into the room, then it's about self-service. How are they going to access the facilities and the services they want? For example, room service, or maybe to book a restaurant table downstairs. Well, they can access it via the telephone as usual, or they can access it via their mobile device potentially. So they can utilize the mobile device, which is connected onto the hotel EPOS system to order room service, or connected directly to the restaurant booking system to book a table downstairs. If they do go downstairs to the restaurant, what do we do at that point? Well, if we are using the table reservation solution, we can utilize that to social distance the tables and also to uh, contact trace. So we know who was in the restaurants at any given point and contact tracing both from a guest perspective and from a staff perspective. Also from the restaurants, are we going to use menus, physical menus or digital menus? Again, do we give them a QR code? They can use their phone to scan the QR code, brings up the hotel menu and they can choose the items themselves and self-serve. Once the guest has stayed, the checkout then becomes important. How do they check out? Do we want them to go to the reception desk or will we email them or use an app to deliver the invoice to them overnight and they can use the app to check out digitally, again from the room without going to the reception desk. Now that's all about the kind of guest journey, which is fine, but we've got to think about the staff and how we protect our staff in the hotel. And a couple of examples would be housekeeping, for example, the room attendants. Are we going to give them some sort of mobile device, perhaps or maybe an Android device, and then they can get the rooming list on that device and they can have the work schedule there, meaning they don't have to get into clusters, get into meetings to get the rooming list. They're not handling any paper. It's all done digitally. And the same with the housekeeping team. They can utilize that device to check on the rooms once they've been cleaned and they've been inspected. We could also use workforce management across the whole hotel so that we can use the scheduling and we can understand who is where at what point on what day. So we know who's there and we can utilise that for contact tracing and management as well. That's our two pen as well. Hope that's OK. Wishing us all the best of luck over the months ahead. Bye.